Now in its ninth week, Dancing on Ice will come to an end this Sunday as one celebrity will be crowned the winner of the 15th series. Although Joey Essex has been wowing the judges throughout the competition, body language expert Darren Stanton explained why the reality star may struggle to outperform his two competitors. Throughout the competition, Joey Essex, the Vivian and Niall Wilson have consistently remained towards the top end of the leaderboard. Last Sunday during the semi-finals, ITV viewers saw Olympian Niall secure the first perfect score of the series as he was awarded 10s across the board from the judging panel. Not far behind was former TOWIE star Joey Essex who managed to get 38 for his emotional skate with professional skating partner Vanessa Bauer. However, his high score wasn't enough to keep him out of the skate-off against the wanted's Shiva Kaneswaran and Coronation Street's Molly Gallagher. Despite the judges deciding to save Joey, which earned him a spot in the final, it looks as though he may struggle to keep up with Niall Wilson and the Vivian according to body language expert Darren Stanton. Speaking on behalf of bookmakers Betfair, Darren revealed he can't see the 32-year-old lifting the trophy this year. He said, for me, Joey was always the wild card of this year's Dancing on Eyes series and it's safe to say he's surprised a lot of people throughout the contest. Joey has been a strong contender and it's obvious he and his partner Vanessa share a strong bond and deep connection. The duo have displayed a great resilience, passion and rapport throughout the series, but I can't see the pair lifting the winning trophy this year. Analyzing his semi-final performance, Joey doesn't seem to be as determined as he once was, with the fire he had to win not being as present as it previously has been. Whether that's due to him feeling fatigued as the competition draws to a close, if he doesn't find the right energy for his final performance, it could dampen his chances of beating out his co-stars and taking the win. However, the body language expert does believe it'll be Gymnast Niall who will be crowned champion due to his consistency and the nomination from the offset. Darren added, he and partner Olivia consistently show great eye contact, reciprocal liking and genuine emotion. Don't miss! Call the midwife Strixie Franklin shares fear of being written out, latest, Naga Manchetti's absence from BBC Breakfast questioned by fans, latest, Kate Garraway calls out Prince Harry for inaccurate Lilibet detail, latest, each performance, the pair are on the same page at every level. This synchronization, matching and mirroring each other's gestures both on and off the ice, within their body language is what is reminiscent of a winning partnership. Last weekend, Nyla and Olivia skated to the Shawn Mendes song In My Blood which he opted to pick as the lyrics conveyed his mental health journey. Before taking to the ice. The gymnast opened up about his surgery in 2019 which resulted in him having to retire from his sport. Admitting retirement had been tough, Niall confessed it resulted in him partying, drinking and gambling. Niall revealed once he started to open up, the weight had been lifted off of his shoulders. After their skate, the judges were blown away by their routine as they awarded the duo a perfect score of 10. Judge Odi Mabuse said, For me, honestly I want to thank you. I want to thank you for being on the show. For always every week pushing yourself but also speaking out about mental health and letting us see you for who you are because that was just delivered to perfection, so well done. Dancing on Ice finale airs on March 12th on ITV from 6.30pm.
Don't